Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I am reviewing finally, after all these days, this Flash 2 pack. Um, sadly, I do not have the other figure that has gone to, excuse me, my cousin Christian Dimitri, cousins. Um, and because I already had that figure, um, just not, you know, with the translucent plastic, and I'll show you actually. Alright, I finally, um, found the, uh, figure, um, but before that, while I'm watching SmackDown 2, some Benjamin and Chad Gable just got the Tag Team Championship, which is, uh, pretty cool. Oh, wait, no, no, never mind, they're not. Wow. Um, something interesting to talk about. Wow. Uh, okay, so, it looks like they didn't... Wow, alright, that's interesting. Um, I wish I could talk more about that, but that's not what we're doing. We're making a review on something else. Um, but yeah. Uh, anyways, <laughs> so this is the other figure, you know, I've already reviewed this, and basically, um, what happened, uh, the, they put in the two-pack this figure, but with translucent plastic and some, uh, accessories, but yeah, my cousin should be making that review soon, um, I w also want to compare this figure to another figure that I picked up, it's the... Also, excuse me, also from the, uh, Rebirth, uh, DC Rebirth, it's this figure, um, I wasn't sure if it, I should have revered, uh, I wasn't sure if I should have reviewed this, I mean, it's a good figure, but I don't know, uh, if you want to see a review, tell me if you do, and I'll review it, but we have this here, uh, another multiverse figure, I don't know why, I just want to compare it. We have Aquaman, Aqu Aquaman here. Um, but anyways, with this figure, I used a Mafex stand just a whole. Other, I never really want to use his stand. Uh, I don't know. I just felt kind of like I don't know. I don't. I don't really know why. I could have used a backdrop or something. But um, with accessories to start off with, we have this back piece that clips in right here. But when it's out, it kind of looks awkward. So yeah, it's kind of something that's. Uh, kind of stupid to me, um, but yeah, it's a really cool accessory. Uh, you can put him in running poses or just standing there looking all cool. Uh, and then he's got these, so like when he's running or something, you know, adds them. It came with two, so you can clip them easily on his arms. It's like soft plastic. Um, but yeah. Uh, and then the last thing for him, they both figures came with this. It's a little stand. They both have their, like, own, uh, logo that it kind of looks like. So his had a silver background and then that little, you know, his more realistic looking light bolt, uh, lightning bolt. His, you know, the more comic, cartoony, uh, but yeah. So, with, um, with... Well, you know, uh, that sign, you know, he's got his more classic sign here, so. Uh, yeah, but, and then you can also use these, uh, I don't know, he, he's usually with the, uh, more yellow lining, uh, yeah. Overall, this figure's really great, it's my first, uh, DC Multiverse Flash figure that's like more uh, from the comics. You know, this one's obviously from the movie. If you didn't know, Flash is my favorite DC uh, character of all time. Not this variation. Uh, it's it was the other one is a Barry from like the future, and he had a blue suit. Uh, I don't know, just a cool comic I watch on a comic store and go check out the channel by the way. Um, yeah, but he just looks so cool, and then it's God Speed. Then it's him. Then it's Kid Flash. Um, the, like, first Kid Flash, not the newer one. But anyways, um, with this figure, the articulation is pretty nice. Uh, we have, you know, your 
360 moving. Uh, and it can't really move much to the sides. Uh, it can look up about that much, which is pretty good, I guess. And it can look down about that much. And I think it's on a ball peg there. Uh, you can kind of see that. Uh, but yeah, it's like on a little ball peg. And then they made the neck in, so, uh, pretty big. So you can see that little ball peg a little bit. Um, but yeah. Then we've got articulation. The arms go up about this much. Uh, and then we got 360 movement all around here. Uh, bicep 2 right here. And arm can't bend to 90 degrees, but it's okay. Uh, and then we got full rotation here. He didn't come with other arms, by the way. Uh, and then got his ab crunch, which Multiverse doesn't usually make the best ab crunch, but I guess it's pretty decent, I guess. Uh, and then we got full 360 rotation at the waist. Uh, and then we have legs can move out. Oh, legs can move out about this far. And then they can uh, move pretty far back, I guess, uh, which is good. And then we have this um, little piece out here that you can do. Uh, which is really cool. I like that. And then you can move all 360 around here. Uh, no movement right here, but it's okay. Uh, no ankle pivot, sadly. And then the foot can, you know, move right here. So it's your, you know, your more basic articulation. That I should show because, I mean, we don't always, uh, show DC Multiverse figures on here. Um... But yeah, if you want to see me review my other multiverse figure, okay, him, uh, again, tell me, and I'll show you. Um, but then, I'm just kind of watching this match, too, which is pretty interesting. Um, but yeah, detail-wise, I think it's really great. Um, if you can tell by the camera, the, the torso part here, the red is just slightly darker than the rest, uh, right here. What a, oh my god. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. This is crazy. Okay, um, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just getting caught up in the match right here. Oh my god, super kicks. Super kicks. <laughs> um, I'm sorry, I keep getting distracted, like, I don't know why, this match is so interesting. <laughs> I think they just won. Yeah, that was cheap. That was a cheap win. Whatever. Um... Anyways, <laughs> uh, the detail on this figure, you know, the detail that they put into the actual suit in the comics is a lot. And, you know, to keep putting that in each one might be a little bit difficult. Uh, I heard when Charnamus Prime uh, reviewed this, they used basically the same figure with a different look to it. Like a different attire um, when they make all their other flashes. So... I mean, it's not that, you know, special, but it's cool to actually even have, like, a more comic one now. Uh, I don't think I really need another one until uh, I see a really good one. Uh, another good Flash figure that looks good to me. Maybe even a little bit more different than this. Uh, you can tell right here they got nice designs. On the treads, really good designing around it, too. You know, it looks like wind or something going back or dust. A uh, lot of good lining, sculpt work, and all that. Uh, at here, I'm kind of mad because here it's it's bent and kind of sucks, but it's okay. You know, I if I really wanted to, I could probably bro, bro, blow dry that uh, for a little bit and then uh, get it, you know, to look more normal. But it's okay, manageable. Uh, Manageable. The arms, the forearm, though, I'm gonna be honest, it looks a little big for the arm. Um, it doesn't look completely right to me. I don't know. Tell me what you think. Um, yeah, that's the review, guys. Sorry if I got a little off track. Just this, I think this might be, like, the match of the night. But, uh, hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like and, to, oh, <laughs> like and subscribe if you haven't already, guys. And, um... I'll see you in tomorrow's video. And peace.